what he's been waiting for us to do. And that is the top five, top fives of 2016. So this is what we did. We know there's a billion top five lists out there. We just did four. Literally, we actually ate because each one of us had one. There's a million top lists out there. We're just going to give you the best of those top five lists in a top five format. Yes. That's how we do it. That is how we do it. So, Brendan, kick us off with your top five, top fives of 2016. Oh, right. At number five, this is some content from a guy on one of those channels I just mentioned. Stuff you should ask for for Christmas. The okay. top five stuff you should ask for for Top Five Friday from the Shady J Show. Shady J is one of the main guys from uh, the Gangsters. And this he okay. talks about some thing I liked about this is he doesn't really pull any punches. It's not like sentimental stuff. It's just it's kind of practical, almost ridiculous stuff to ask for as a present. Uh, mm -hmm. it, like one of the things is like pay my bills. Like uh, all right, <laughs> so. <laughs> So it's yeah. big stuff too. It's like, hey, if people are asking you, you just tell them straight up. Like, hey, they want to get you something. Be honest. Don't, don't try to <laughs> screw around. <laughs> so so I, I bills, appreciate yeah. that. Uh, okay. So at number four, number we four. have the top five Christmas movies by 8-Bit Eric, which I saw this on Vidme, even though it's also on YouTube. Um, yeah, I, I liked it. It was going through... Um, all the classic Christmas movies and some newer ones. Um, I, I liked what he had to say about them and maybe it hit me a little bit more because I was realizing how many of those movies, Christmas movies that I used to watch all the time that are not on Netflix or Amazon for streaming mm. suspiciously yeah. when I wanted to watch them this year, but he hit a lot of them. So, so that was nice. Um, right. number three, number three, so, top five game show moments of 2016. This is actually from Yahoo. Ha Some had this. game shows on. Yeah, so that's the thing. Like, I'm not that... I don't care that much about game shows. Um, I see them every once in a while. But this... Uh, apparently, we've been missing out on at least five pretty hilarious moments on some game shows. And, okay. and I was actually surprised that uh, these were pretty... pretty. It was a pretty cool top five uh, game show moments of 2016. Cool. Okay. All right. At number, number two. Two. The top five rejected top fives from CNET. <laughs> okay. So it's getting a little meta. And I, I like yeah. meta top fives. And it was pretty good. They explained, because they do a bunch of top fives, they explained uh, five of them that they rejected uh, because and hmm. explained why um, they didn't do those particular top fives because it was going to have some complications. And well, now at number no, one, no, you don't, no, you don't have to, you don't have to do number one. Okay, both of our number ones is going to be the same. It so. will be the same. It will be the same. So just so you all know, spoiler alert: me and Britain's number one is the same. I'm just going to start my top five, top fives of 2016, starting off with number five, and that would be barbecue recipes. The top five barbecue recipes of 2016. Now this is put out by Pitmaster S, and if you like barbecue, which I do, yeah, go get some recipes and make some barbecue. Who, who doesn't love barbecue for I I do actually like uh, Pitmasters too. That's another. Uh, so there you go. All right, my next top five is the top five surreal news stories of 2016, and this is put out by UPI.com. And let's just give you a, a, a sampling of top one of the, the news stories that is surreal. And if you think about it, it really is. It's like how the hell did we get here? And Donald Trump is elected president. So <laughs> they're just like, hey, we're crazy people. Yeah. Yeah, so check it out. Uh, they, you'll look at some of these things and be like, yeah, that did happen, didn't it? I tried to forget about it. But it is what it is. Uh, number three would be the Fumbles uh, top five list of L's of 2016. So it's just like just embarrassing sports moments or horrible sports moments like uh, how the Cleveland Indians uh, were up three to one and then lost to the Cubs somehow in that series. Same with the Golden State Warriors were up three to one in their series and and did it in Austin. There's some other really funny ones in there. So go ahead and check that out for your top five L's of 2016 from the fumble. Then number two is the top five games. I had to have a top five games in here somewhere. And that is from Den of Geek. Not because our games are similar. I think they're pretty different. But uh, I just, you know, I like these guys. And they, they put out some interesting stuff. And it's a nice different set of top five games than rather what I, my opinions. So I went with that. And... 
And you all know what number one is. I, I don't even think we need to. Brendan, what's number one for both of us? Number one is. Number one is. The top five, top fives. My words from my Hell face. Yes, top five, top five. How can that be number one? This is We're giving you five. We're actually giving you eight different top five lists all in one top five, top fives. Like, I mean, this is amazing. We are just blowing people's minds with our top five, top five. Yes. And, and you know what? We we often do this somewhat as a joke, but this year I was looking around. I I was disappointed with a lot of the top fives this year, but I, I was pleased with ours. I was very pleased. There you go. There we you really go. and we, we pack it in for you. We just mm-hmm. rushed through we <laughs> went diverse too. Like our top fives were very different. Like, yeah, I had the, the obligatory like game one, but you know, everything else is pretty different for our top five lists. You know? And you know what? I want everyone else to share in this the glory of this top five, top five. And tell us your top five, top fives. Tell us your top five of all of this. Because yeah. I, would like, I really would like to see our, uh, it would be great to see this video and all the other videos with people's top fives. And just for everyone to be able to look through all the comments section, just see the top fives. I, I, I really want to see that. Add to right. it. Well, let's get it. Make moving. it the best top five, it, top five ever. Comments down below, of course, at Words of My Face on Twitter, Google Plus on Facebook. Oh, there's good ways of getting a hold of.